Hey boys, welcome back to another one today. This is gonna be my first MM22 video um, of the year, so it's pretty, pretty exciting. I'm sorry they've been delayed. I've had some technical difficulties, but I have been playing the game, so I do have like coins, cash, stamina. I have good, pretty, pretty good team. But anyway, today's video is gonna be on your daily grind schedule, what you should be doing every single day when you hop into the game, when you should come back into the game, um, what you should and shouldn't do. Before we start the video, please make sure to drop a like and subscribe. We are on the road to 100 subs if we can get there before September 15th. That would be pretty awesome. Um, my description tag, I guess you could say, will pop up right here or my username. Um, so DM me on Discord if you want to join my Discord server. So um, first thing when you log on to the game is you're probably first going to want to go to leagues. So what I'm going to do, just so I don't forget, play if you have championships to play. Um, look at chat, just to see if there's anything, if they need you or anything. Play your drives, that's pretty, pretty important. Plus, you can go to the league store and buy some stuff. Uh, champion store, you look right here, I have 12,000. So, that's pretty, pretty good. Um, so yeah, that's pretty, pretty good. Um, next thing I would do is I would go straight to training center, and I would play your player events, training point event, coins, trophies, and stamina. Those events are pretty, pretty good. Um, plus, these, you don't cost any stamina, so bang, 75 stamina free right there. That's pretty, pretty nice. Then you can watch two ads daily for some stamina. That's pretty, pretty nice. Um, refresh is daily at 10.30, 2.30, or er, yeah, 10.30 a.m., 2.30 p.m., 6.30 p.m., and 10.30 p.m. at night. So make sure to claim that so you can get some stamina. But play the coins, players, trophies, and training points events just to get some more um, things in the game. Um, daily goals, obviously don't just, I mean, you don't have to just grind out all the daily goals, but as you're playing, try and complete most of the daily goals. Next thing I would do is go to uh, journeys and see if you can complete any other events, like right here. I don't think I complete this event. Yeah, so I can't complete this event. Um, after that, I would go to programs and complete the Battle of the North or the whatever program you have. Um, and you just got to click this and then you start um i haven't actually been doing that i'm probably gonna grind that later tonight and then also the tour the tour is actually a very good way to get players fast after this michael thomas i'm pretty sure you get a i think it's chase young and then a derrick henry so that's pretty pretty nice you need to get those um also this right here is very very good it's a, a madden pack those are very very nice um for free to play so yeah just play your events and um play events that have easy like bonuses or whatever so 250 passing years that it's gonna be kind of hard bonus five touchdowns all the time that'll be kind of hard do the easy ones first um bonus punt return over 40 yards that, that that's pretty easy um seven points in the game that's pretty easy so i would do the raiders rams giants and then dolphins in that order um stay away from these just because they don't give you as much um like this is 4k i don't want that um it's a half game. It's even longer because it's 45 second halves. 45 second quarters. So that's actually technically for what you get way worse than doing this. So, yeah, boys, that's pretty much that. Um, um, then what you're going to want to do is go into Arena and play your daily two events. I have not been playing Arena. Why? Well, I, I played one game. Just to see what it was like. Um, but play Arena. That's actually pretty, pretty important. Go to Trades. Um... Now, I'll probably have a video later on the best trades to do, um, the most worth it, but, like, um, I would save up with, like, these things, these Genesis bonus keys right now, um, but the 10k is really good, this is very, very good, um, bang, so you can claim this, and then, um, just, this is easy 10k every single day, this two right here, this is super easy, um, Bang, 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 bang. Right there. There we go. So, five. Another 10K. So, that is 20K I got just from pretty much logging onto the game. And if you play those player events, this 10K coins is easy. Um, and you should be able to complete this if you play that player event. The helmets are probably... Or, the helmets are a very good thing to do. I just don't do them. Um, these are pretty good. You can get some good players. Like... Yeah, I've, I've pulled an 83. I No was an 83. I upgraded into an 83. Anyway, I got a pretty good player out of that, so, um, 
it's worth it in their daily goals. Um, complete some achievements. Um, I would also check if there's any, like, deals in the store, like bonus common play right here. Boom. Easy. This is probably not going to, this isn't probably going to go on my team, but bang, there we go. Um, that does help. Well, I can put that in set to get more coins, but currencies just check for daily deals. No really good deals here. Um, champion store, no deals. So yeah, um, that's pretty much going to be the video, um, and recap. I guess I can do some recap here. So what you want to do, do daily goal, we'll do leagues first. And as you're doing stuff, complete daily goals. Go into training center, complete all of those events, claim your stamina, go to programs, um, do if you're trying to grind the tour or battle for the north, do that. If you don't know how to work something, you can go into um, rookie center just to learn what to do, um, play arena, complete daily goals, go into trades, complete those coins, um, complete these resources, ones right here. These are very, very good. Journey, I would save up on these right now. This Uncommon is actually pretty, pretty good. I, if I was going to get one, I would probably get that. Um, definitely not the Pro Pack. That's not worth it. I don't really think the coins are worth it either. 400 cash would be pretty good. Rare player would be pretty, pretty good. Um, anyway, boys, that is going to be the video. If you enjoyed, drop a like and subscribe. It really means a lot. Lines for Life Gaming is out. Peace.